వెల్కమ్ టు వి న్యూస్ తెలంగాణ ఫేక్ గోల్డ్ బిస్కెట్లను అమ్ముతున్న అంతర్రాష్ట్ర ముఠా గుట్టురాట్టు చేసిన రాచకొండ పోలీసులు ఆంధ్రప్రదేశ్ రాష్ట్రం నెల్లూరు జిల్లాకు చెందిన ముగ్గురు గుంటూరు జిల్లాకు చెందిన వ్యక్తి మొత్తం నలుగురు సభ్యులు ఒక ముఠాగా ఏర్పడి దొంగ బంగారు బిస్కెట్లను అమ్ముతున్నారు పోలీసులు తెలిపిన వివరాల ప్రకారం నకిలీ బంగారం బిస్కెట్లను మార్కెట్ రేట్ కన్నా తక్కువ రేటుకు ఇస్తామని నమ్మబలికి మొదట్లో తక్కువ మొత్తంలో ఒరిజినల్ బంగారాన్ని బాధితులకు ఇచ్చి నమ్మకం కలిగాక పెద్ద మొత్తంలో బంగారాన్ని వారికి అమ్మేందుకు గోల్డ్ కోటింగ్ వేసిన నకిలీ బంగారం బిస్కెట్లను అంటకడుతున్నారు అదే విధంగా బాధితుల దగ్గర డబ్బులు తీసుకున్నాక సూడో పోలీసులను పోలీస్ డ్రెస్ లో స్పాట్ కు తీసుకొచ్చి బాధితులను భయపెట్టే విధంగా చేస్తూ పెద్ద మొత్తంలో డబ్బులు కాజేస్తున్నట్లు రాచకొండ కమిషనర్ జోషి మీడియాకు తెలియజేశారు మేడిపల్లికి చెందిన దిలీపు బర్పా అనే వ్యక్తి నిందితుల వద్ద మోసపోయి మేడిపల్లి పోలీసులకు సమాచారం అందించారు పోలీసులు విచారణ చేసి నిందితులను అదుపులోకి తీసుకున్నారు నిందితుల వద్ద నుండి మూడు కార్లు ఒక పోలీసు యూనిఫామ్ ఆరు కోట్ల ఎనభై ఆరు లక్షల రూపాయలు ఫేక్ కరెన్సీ ఐదు కేజీల ఫేక్ గోల్డ్ బిస్కెట్లు యాభై ఒక్క లక్షల రూపాయల నగదును స్వాధీనం చేసుకున్నారు These are duplicate items and uh, this is looking, again this is also looking almost original. See 100 grams, 5 gold, triple 9.9, this is generally for 20. The 2 liters, this is, it is looking like solid but it's found. And uh, you know they, they carry it like this. But otherwise, generally they are creating some concealed compartments for the whole pet tip. మొత్తం రాష్ట్రంకి ఫోకస్ ఉంది వి ఆర్ వర్కింగ్ విత్ ద అబ్జెక్టివ్ విత్ ది ఉద్దేశం ఏమిటి వీ వాంట్ టు మేక్ ద ఎంటైర్ స్టేట్ అస్ అ డ్రగ్ ఫ్రీ స్టేట్ ఇన్ ఆల్ ఆస్పెక్ట్స్ ఇన్ టర్మ్స్ ఆఫ్ ప్రొటెక్షన్ ఆర్ ఎనీ కల్టివేషన్ ఇన్ టర్మ్స్ ఆఫ్ ట్రాన్స్పోర్టేషన్ in terms of uh, peddling in terms of supply in terms of storage in terms of consumption so multi pronged strategy adopted see we are putting in uh, all efforts to uh, do the enforcement of course there any it's a multi pronged strategy so we are focusing a lot on the awareness that is educating the people educating the youngsters are in this lavish lifestyle is also engaging in the property offenses for example they are cases like mobile theft or cases like snatching of the money money snatching or bag snatching so there are court cases in hyderabad uh, nagar and abdullapur met which are also not very old 2019 nunchi 2023 varaku ee four cases of other than ntps also is involved so practically speaking there are six cases against uh, this accused person so we have uh, taken them into custody and uh, under ntps case has been booked and uh, they will be sent for the remand and this job this work has been done by the sot this is rendu ndps cases only book to the detect chesaru the first one uh, the the first accused name is bharat reddy who is a drug peddler very young actually just 21 years of age is a dropout from a good college i don't want to name the educational institution but he is a dropout from a good college very lavish lifestyle and he wants to go abroad actually he wants to go abroad and you know they are uh, trying to earn money through this illicit means and they have a record kuda on this is not the only incident so he is a drug peddler the second person's name is vikya again inka takwa vaisu is only a teenager he is a 19 year old boy a major but otherwise only 19 year old so you can imagine they are all they are both very very young boys and these people have procured about 26 grams of mdma from bangalore so these people intak mundu kuda vallu supply chestunaru they are they are having some group of people in the, you know in vallaki uh, communication lo unnaru and they regularly check the, the the demand for this these kind of drugs so mdma everybody andarki telsu the methylene dioxy meth amphetamine it's a very potent kind of uh, drug and uh, in common language we call it ecstasy that's a common term 
and uh, the moment you consume it, it gives a lot of hallucinations. So it gives a kick to the consumer. So this 26 grams, it's it's uh, they have procured it in small packets from Bangalore, and generally what they do is they procure they acquire it to procure chesi. In case rate increase chesi, they acquire it to distribute or supply chesta. So normally, if we see, they will get it for 12, 1300 rupees, and they will sell it for 4500 to 5000 rupees. Uh, per gram, per gram at the rate of it. So in this particular case, about 26.7 grams, uh, they have they have brought it from there. And the third, the person is a consumer, who is again a 25 year old boy. is a he is a private job, doing a private job. His name is Hemant Kumar, and he is a native of Hyderabad. So this uh, the first actuals of Bharat Reddy, while the background shows that in that mundu kora. Uh, Hyatt Nagar low plus Abdullah Parameter in the Interpundu current NDPS cases only. So that means he was earlier also involved in similar kind of drug offenses. So he is a regular drug peddler. So he is very young, only 21 year old, but he has been regularly involving in this. Apart from that, Inca four cases only. And uh, the first person's name is Dinesh, P. Dinesh. Again, uh, he is a 28 year old man. If you see, any, most of the accused people are very young. He is working as a car mechanic and he is also a drug peddler. His associate, his name is uh, Amartulli Honest and he is a carpenter. And again, he is also a young 29 year old. Both of them are natives of Borabanda in Hyderabad city. In Indri Kalsi, they have brought this hash oil. Now, hash oil is also another very potent kind of uh, drug. It is a, a partly liquid uh, drug which is obtained from hashish. And, uh, Again, it is it is it is very it's a uh, very uh, more potent than marijuana or from the poppy. It is it is effective much higher. And if you see this uh, tetrahydrocannabidiol is the main composition of this. And even a consumption of one drop also, very small amount also it will give an impact. So it is highly concentrated. So these people they have been able to procure about uh, two liters of hashish oil. From uh, Narsi Patnam area of Vishakapatnam. So that is that is agency area under Kitelsu. It's a it's a majorly tribal area. And uh, they have some sources in those places and we are working to get the other uh, background sources for memo workout chestunamo. Generally in all these cases the origin and the destination are also equally important. So Dan Dan Gurunchi Koda memo efforts Pektunamo, which is the original source and how they are able to do all this activity. Uh, without uh, any deterrence or without any, uh, any anybody stopping. The third person is a consumer. He is also a private job uh, doing person. His name is uh, Tala Pali Bharani and he is also native of Boravanda. So these three cases, uh, we have uh, this the awareness agenda is Cheptunam. This coming 26th of June is also uh, anti-drugs international on enforcement activity investigation. Strengthening our officers for good surveillance for Cheptunam. So, in accordance with our Rendu NDPS cases, only, both the cases were booked by the excise department people, uh, that is in the uh, Balanagar excise police station of Bukha and And one case was in 2021 and one case was in 2023. So, in, in these two cases, uh, we have, we have uh, arrested these six people in two different cases. And uh, we are putting in all efforts to identify the other people, the other consumers, the other peddlers. People who are linked to this these incidents, both in the you know this on the forward side and on the backward side. So the memo the education institutions lo kora chala nega petto namo and we are in touch with everybody and uh, uh, we are making some anti drug committees and anti drug clubs to get more information. The request with the public is that uh, if you see any youth or anybody who is addicted or who is addicted to this drugs related issue or who is frequently involved in this kind of anti-social activities or who is leading a very lavish lifestyle or who information is there, we can do some discrete checkup and we can verify. About Desham in the starting of Chepyanu that we want the entire Telangana to become free of the drugs and in that regard the entire police department is actively involved. So uh, all these above arrested people, they are uh, uh, they are being sent for the judicial demand. Uh, SOT DCP Murli that is there and his team members, uh, we, they have done a good job and uh, we will be doing more enforcement 
on this drugs issue in the coming days history also so it is mutam property seize and the plus any property uh, accused ki court samakshan lo produce chestamu they will be remanded and that property we will deposit before the court the genuine uh, currency which is seized uh, that of course to the court release chesi victim ki istamu that will be done through the court public ki oka appeal undi that uh, any such uh, uh, you know scam or any such information meku vaste di jewelry or any gold items meku takwa amount lo istamu please do not believe atla vaste kuda generally you know the people are getting some emails or through some friends the common friends nunchi konta mandi cheptaru some people are coming from other states and they are selling the gold for cheap amount first time definitely the takwa amount suppose whatever 2 grams or then they will give genuine only and that is basically for luring the customer to make them believe and the first time genuine is they kachithanga valu adi namakam padtundi and they will give more money but subsequently the future transactions are all bogus so please check out the gold rates in the market and see that you know enta cheap amount valu etla istharu so definitely it is suspicious mee dagra atla information vaste మీకు అట్లా అది అని ఎనీబడి ఇస్ ట్రైంగ్ టు అప్రోచ్ యూ యూ కెన్ గివ్ ద ఇన్ఫర్మేషన్ టు పోలీస్ డిపార్ట్మెంట్ మేము వెరిఫై చేస్తాము ఇఫ్ ఇట్ ఈస్ దేర్ వీ విల్ ఇన్ఫార్మ్ యూ బట్ జనరలీ డో నాట్ కమ్ ఇన్ టు ఎనీ సచ్ యూనో టాక్ ఆఫ్ ద పబ్లిక్ అది ఎనీ సచ్ థింగ్ ఇట్ ఈస్ జనరలీ ఫౌండ్ అవుట్ టు బి ఎ స్కామ్ అండ్ ఇట్ ఈస్ లార్జ్ స్కేల్ చీటింగ్ విచ్ పీపుల్ దీస్ పీపుల్ ఆర్ డూయింగ్ సో ది పాత కేసెస్ ఇఫ్ యూ సీ దీస్ ఆల్ దీస్ ప్రీవియస్ థర్టీన్ కేసెస్ ఇన్ విచ్ దే ఆర్ ఇన్వాల్వ్ Uh, they are involved in since long time up to 2010 nunchi chestunaru madhye madhyalo almost every year there are cases in 2010 2011 2015 2017 2021 2023 so these people are regularly involved in the similar offense and that is why the repeated involvement in, uh, that is why the history sheet has been opened against these people